Welcome back, everyone. You may be in a situation where you want to go ahead and turn on or off the background app refresh for certain applications. Now, what this basically does is it gives you the ability of hiding certain applications technically in the background. So basically, if you don't want certain applications to have access to any notification pushing or any data in the background, well, you can go and turn this off. So if you don't want TikTok snooping on your phone or sending notifications, we can turn off background app refresh. Now, you don't want to do this for every app. But to start off, you want to make your way over to your settings application. You can then scroll down until you see this little general option down here, which we can go and click on right there. And then we'll see a little option down here that says background app refresh. So it's not even down here, it's right up here. So what we want to do is we want to click on background app refresh. And here we will basically be able to configure whether we want background app refresh on, which I would recommend keeping on. You can keep it off or Wi-Fi and Wi-Fi and cellular data, whatever you want to do. But what you want to do here is you want to go through each individual option here and you want to turn off background app refresh on really mostly the application that you're not using. Now, do keep in mind, if you turn off background app refresh, you probably won't be notified of those applications. So let's say you use Snapchat, you want to turn it off, but you still want to be notified. There's really no way to do it unless you're on the application 24-7. You need to keep these toggles on. But personally, I don't care if I get, ref you know, attacked or noti notified of the podcast application. So we can go ahead and turn it off like this. Same thing with books. I don't really care about that application. But, you know, even apps like Maps or Snapchat or TikTok or Twitter, sometimes maybe you want to be notified of them. So you want to go and keep them on. But that is pretty much how you can go and configure your specific background app refreshes for your application. And you can pretty much go on from there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.